My name is Ahmad Yunus. I'm a senior technical marketing engineer here at VMware. And today we're going to talk about the vCenter Server Appliance as the default deployment. The vCenter Server Appliance has many benefits in 6.5, which can be broken up into three different categories. The first is operational. We have things like a single point of support. Uh, the next is features. There are exclusive features only to the vCenter Server Appliance, like native high availability and backup restore as well as time. vCenter Server Appliance doesn't take any time to get up and running, giving the VI admin a lot of, giving the VI admin time to focus on day two. Let's walk through some of these features and benefits as well. First, from an operational perspective, the vCenter Server Appliance is quick to deploy. Mount the ISO, go through the deployment wizard, and you're up and running. There's no opera operating system or database licensing required. There's hardly any database maintenance that's needed because the vPostgres database is already tuned for the vCenter server, v -Center server application. We also have unified patching, where from the, the vSphere appliance management UI, you can now patch not only the operating system, the, the application, and the database all in one click and single point of support. We now have Photon OS as the underlying operating system for the vCenter server appliance. So now VMware is the single point of support for the operating system, application, and database. Next are the exclusive features dedicated to the vCenter server appliance in 6.5. We have native vCenter server high availability. We have an embedded HTML5 vSphere client. We have vSphere monitoring in the form of the vSphere appliance management UI, giving you the capability to get more visibility into the appliance, things like CPU, memory, network utilization, as well as visibility into the database. We have RESTful APIs, which you can view and interact with in the API Explorer. We have native file-based backup restore. VMware's update manager is now included as part of the appliance. We have a two-stage deployment where stage one deploys the appliance and stage two does the configuration. And finally, we have migration tools to allow you to get from a Windows-based vCenter server directly to the appliance. Check out some of these features at the VMware product walkthrough and remember to check out pubs.vmware.com. Thank you.